Hey YouTubers, Mike Boris with the Mike Boris channel. Thank you for watching. Today we're talking jet ski engine performance and there is a part tied into your air intake system called a check valve that if it's ignored and not replaced every two to three years, your engine performance will suffer. Let's hit the computer and show you exactly what part I'm talking about. All right, YouTubers on the home page of CNC Sports. This is an awesome website and we have a sea -Doo. We will select sea -Doo. We have a watercraft, 2003. And our model is GTX-DI, DI standing for direct injection. Select that. And this is my favorite part of this website. It's basically set up like the apps on your phone for each system. Air intake system, body front view, body rear view, cooling system, and all the additional systems that make up your awesome jet ski. I'm going to scroll up to the top. We are working on the air intake system. Select that. And this page is really awesome. It gives you a full diagram of your entire air intake system. I'm going to press the positive button, scroll in a bit, and select and drag. And what I want to focus on is part number 74 right here. It is a check valve. And coming to the right is a list in numerical order of all of the parts. I'm going to scroll all the way down to part number 74. Again, check valve part number 275500398. It is $8.99 and it is available because it is red and it allows us to select that or add it. So with that said, now that we know what the part is called and how much it costs, again, coming back over here to part 74, that is your check valve and its sole purpose is as it's titled. It is a check valve and what check valves do is they create a one-way flow or direction for whatever system they are tied to. In our case, the air intake system. So what that check valve is doing is creating a one-way direction for air such as exhaust gases as well as crankcase pressure. And as you can see with the diagram, you have an arrow facing toward the crankcase and carter, which shows us that this specific check valve is ultimately not allowing any of the gases or pressure to come out of the crankcase and flow upward in the system toward additional part numbers up here and create any back pressure flow through this part here. So with that said, in the event that this check valve fails, you will notice a significant change in your engine performance, and trust me, not for the better your engine performance will be degraded and your engine may begin sputtering as well as not allowing the engine to peak out at its top speed or may run in a manner where you think your spark plug is fouling and must be replaced, which in that case may lead you to replace your spark plug and when you finally do it, you may notice that your spark plug is perfectly fine. So again, part number 74, check valve, part number, cost, and you can purchase it on this website. In our case, we are going to replace this part. And as you can see, the part has hoses on each side and clamps that secure the hoses onto the nipple portions of the check valve. So what I want to do from here is show you what the actual part looks like after I order it and the part is delivered to our house. All right, YouTubers, great news. The part is in. Again, part number 275500398. There it is, the little check valve. And again, the sole purpose of this check valve is to direct air in one direction and one direction only, not allow the air to flow back and forth. So this is a very important part. Again, this part gets gunked up and fails. Your engine performance will degrade and you will definitely notice a difference. So with that said, just wanted to show you the part. That's it YouTubers, a quick explanation of the check valve part itself. It's a pretty important part as you can see. Now we are going to replace that part on our actual jet ski engine. Scrolling above is a link to a step-by-step -step video that shows you how to replace that check valve. From here, do us a favor below the video, you will see that thumbs up icon. Click on that, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Definitely go to your settings, turn on your YouTube notification bell. Once you do that, every video that we upload, you will be notified. You will be able to stay up to date with us, and that would be awesome. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you at the next video.